If your car is throwing this 0, 0, 5, 7, 3 error code when scanned, then your steering is probably harder or stiffer than usual. The code is specific to VW cars like Jetta and Golf Series, as at the time of making this video, and the most common symptom is hard steering. The lessons in this video will help you understand how to solve this problem in this particular cars and other car brands too, because the assist power steering technology is pretty similar for most car brands. The problem is usually from the power steering assisted system, and is often written as DTC00573 steering torque sensor, G269. To solve this issue and make your steering run smooth again, you need to pay attention to the following. 1. Check steering assist power supply, terminal 15. You don't know where the terminal 15 is. No problem. Just like this video, subscribe to our channel, and follow me there. Forget the jargon, terminal 15 in most cars is simply battery power when car is switched on. It should reference plus OR12V depending on how you position your probe. It runs all over the car. Use your multimeter to trace it among the wires that goes to the power assisted steering system. With the engine on, locate the wiring harness that powers power assist steering. This is located just behind the battery in the engine compartment. When you disconnect the wiring harness, the signal communication with your scanner will be lost. Reconnect it back to gain the signal, the steering will get back soft as easy as should be. However, if this happens, don't be tricked, the problem will come back again. So to eradicate the problem completely, continue. If it does not return your steering to original smoothness continue too. Check for any breakage or jam in the wires. Any of such in the power steering assistance plug, resulting in drop in voltage will cause the problem. You can use your car's wiring diagram to trace it, but it is usually all red in most cars. 2. Check the connector and make sure that all of the pins and the wiring are in good shape. Then thoroughly, clean both the plug and the connector. Sometimes, while wires are not broken, grounding lugs may cause these issues. You will notice up to 6 grounding there, near the connector. Take each of those grounds off, clean them thoroughly, then spray them down with some battery terminal protectant before reinstalling. Like I said before, sometimes, the problem is caused by corrosion in the grounds, and a simple cleaning of the corrosion will save you all the expenses. If you have done all these, and the problem is still persisting, then the next culprit is. 3. Check fuses. There are two major fuses that controls the power steering. Fuse SA280 amp fuse. This is found in the engine compartment fuse box located at rear left of engine compartment. Fuse 3, 5 amp fuse, in the fuse box at left side of dash. Use your multimeter and place one lead on either side of the 80 amp fuse to see if there is 12 versus if not, it is blown. Also check the fuse 3 to see if it intact. If not, replace any or both fuses. 4. Check wiring, connectors from, to steering torque sensor, G269. This is usually the most problematic component if all else are good. But all else may not be good in your case, and that is why you need to continue. 5. Check steering torque sensor, G269, itself. 6. Faulty electric power control module, or, 7. Bad steering torque sensor. The steering torque sensor is located in between steering rack and steering shaft. Get off the steering rack and remove and replace and calibrate the torque sensor. 8. Go to channel 44 with your VAG or OBD11 scanner. Locate steering interface and erase fault code. This is the standard.